Hello, welcome back to the JMB. What you see here is 30 quart tub with six leghorn chickens in. And as you can see, we're in the camper here. It's winter time, and this is how I'm keeping the chicks warm. It's a constant 80 to 85 degrees inside the, the cooler there on my counter. We put them up there at bedtime and take them down and put them in front of the window in the daytime for the sun to heat up. Let's go ahead and look in here and I'll show you. Trying to get in there so see the temperature. It's 80 degrees, 82, 83 degrees in there. You see they're already starting to get their little wing feathers. But that's six leghorn chicks. This is how we we keep them here in the camper. And when they sleep, you know, they huddle up against the wall over here where the flame is. It's not don't catch on fire or anything. And then In the day, when there's no sun, we take our water bottle, fill it up, place a towel on it, place it down in there, and they all jump on that and huddle up against it when they get cold. And it seems to, to work out fine. We heat it up to 170 to 100, 160 to 170 degrees. And put a towel around it and it stays hot for uh, in the towel about six to eight hours and then uh, we also sleep with one um, to put in the bed with us and it'll stay hot for 12 hours and that's just how we stay you know help stay warm more so in the camper and seems to work fine I mean you know like I said we heat them up to 100 and heat the water to 160 to 170 degrees and about 45 minutes to an hour before bedtime we'll place them in the bed and then when we get in, come time for bed we got a warm bed to get in you know warm covers and that's pretty much our electric blankets per se here on the homestead so I just took that and applied that to the chicks and uh, they seem to love it like I said you know not lost any due to freezing or anything of that nature But there you have it. Six leg horns. Now I couldn't tell you which one's rooster and which one's hens at this point. Although there are a um, don't know exactly how accurate it is but if you hold them up by the nap of the neck and if they drop their legs then they're a rooster and if they keep them pulled up to their chest then they're a hen like I said I don't know how accurate that is but uh, I said the only sure way to tell which way it is is 
turn them upside down and just barely squeeze them and if the little thing comes out it's a rooster if not it's a boy but you know it's you hurt them that way and possibly kill them squeeze them too much but uh, outside of that though, that's about it thank you for watching